Now let's build another menu, but let's make it animated this time. I'm going to go up to N5 and go down to Build Wizards and select the Menu Builder again. This time I'm going to choose the Sliding Door menu type. And just to see how it looks, since we haven't tested it yet, let's change the UI color to light. And I'm going to click Build It. And it's just going to take a second to build this menu, generate all the items, and it's ready to use. You can see uh, momentarily when one of those items was selected, there was quite a bit going on. So I'm just going to scroll over. I'm going to switch the view mode in here so I can see things off page. And you can see this menu sitting on the side of the page. And it's very similar to the compact menu, except that it spans the height of the page. It's sitting off the edge, and when we view it, it's actually going to animate in. From here, you can do any kind of styling you want. Let's take a look at how one of these menus looks in the output. Here I am in the web browser after exporting with N5, and you can see the menu is sitting over here. I can select it, it opens up, gives me all these menu options. I can close it, it animates away and changes back to that original icon. And again, just like before, all of these items are active and working. Already we've seen that you can do a huge amount just with this menu builder, but we're not even done with the menu builder yet. Let's take a look at one more type of menu that we can build in the next video.